Knoxville firefighters will soon wear a piece of gear some never thought they might need. The department is buying more than 100 bulletproof vests to keep their first rep responders safe on some emergency calls. 10 News reporter Mark Salinger explains the need for this protective gear. Fire buildings, collapse, things like that. Those are just, you know, that's part of the territory. A firefighter's job is to save others. Being shot at, um, you know, that's something new to us. Now they'll begin using something that may one day save their own life. It's a sad day uh, that, that we're even having to discuss this, that we may become a target ourselves. Bulletproof vests will soon be added to the tools Knoxville firefighters carry on board their trucks. The department plans to purchase one for every firefighter on shift at any given time. About 100 coming with a total price tag of nearly $100,000. Firefighters going into a fire right now wear gear that weighs almost 75 pounds. When it comes to bulletproof vests, they aren't sure yet if they would wear it underneath the jacket or on top. That would all depend on what's easier for them to do their job. I see it being worn more on, on domestic calls, um, you know, shooting type situations. Knoxville is far from the first to equip firefighters with protective armor. KFD says firefighters in Memphis and Chattanooga are issued vests as well. It's all so they can begin treating victims even before a threat is over. If the person is still in there on the loose, the shooter, uh, there's people in there dying. Learning hard lessons from the past. It's sad to say, but it's just a sign of the times. To save lives in the future. Mark Salinger, WBIR 10 News. And Rural Metro is also considering equipping its firefighters with bulletproof vests. KFD says there are no plans to arm their firefighters with guns, but that is not out of the realm of possibility in the future.